What's up mga kap? It's me, Kap Joey of Kap Unity Canada. Isang magandang umaga na naman po sa'yo. We are looking for a housekeeping po mga kap. And the best thing about this housekeeping, you are London permanent resident. Totoo po mga kap. Housekeeping, permanent resident dito sa Canada. How true it is. Totoo, totoo po mga kap. And introducing to you the program of Nova Scotia, Provincial Nomination Program Light Duty Cleaner. And dito po mga kap, ito po yung mga requirements. I'm going to flush the requirements. So, or simply visit the Nova Scotia Immigration website and you can see po mga kap yung program ng, Canada, ng Nova Scotia Provincial Nomination Occupation in Demand. So, I'm going to run down the requirements for the occupation in demand. Number one po mga kap, is you need to have a full-time job offer from the employer na, na nandito sa loob ng Nova Scotia. So, again, the business or the employer must be in Canada and the job offer is a light duty cleaner or NOC 65310. Again, NOC 65310 position is light duty cleaner and aside from job offer from a Nova Scotia employer and a light duty cleaner you need to have at least one year experience a related experience for one year 21 to 55 years old and you have a training and a, a language test to mark up which is CLB4 if you don't have a CLB uh, you don't have language test I strongly suggest to take the highest score as possible. As I mentioned, always Canada is known, um, known po mga kap na palaging pabago-bago ang mga requirements. Just in case na magbago ang requirements ng language test, at least po mga kap, mataas ang nakuha mo. So we strongly suggest po mga kap, even the requirement is CLB4, it doesn't mean na yan ang target mo. I strongly suggest to get the highest score as possible. And of course, you need to show a proof of funds if you're applying for NSP and POID or Nova Scotia Provincial Nomination Program Occupation in Demand. So if you're applying to this program, you need to show that you are capable to support yourself. That's why they're requiring you a proof of funds. The proof of funds for a single is 13000 If you want to learn more about or to get the list, I want you to check your comment section. I'm going to put the link where you can click the, click the link and learn what are the proof of funds for a family of two, a family of three, a family of five. So again, Pumakap, that's the NSPNP program. So if you are housekeeping and you're looking to immigrate here in Canada, you already have more than one year housekeeping and you're planning to immigrate here in Canada, apply now. I'm going to put the link on the description below in the comment section if you're watching in YouTube. Check the comment section for Makap. If you're watching on our social media, Facebook, just click the link on the description below and you submit or apply to our online forms. And our team will contact you Pumaka for job interview. Yes, Pumaka, there's a job positions, there's an employer na naghihintay sa'yo, but again, it will depend on the employer kung kayo po ay kukunin. That's why we're going to conduct an interview first before we start the application. So if you're interested, I want you to put in the comment sections. If you're qualified, comment as well and share this video Pumaka to your family and friends that with one year experience as a housekeeping. When you say housekeeping, Pumaka, preferably ang ating employer ay they preferred someone that has experience in housekeeping in the hotel. So if you have experience in the hotel, that's a bogey points, additional bogey points, additional points, kasi ito yung preferred ng ating mga employers. So if you have experience housekeeping in other industries, maybe you're housekeeping in a corporate world, maybe you are housekeeping in the hospital, you can still submit to Makap. If you don't have an experience in housekeeping, please don't apply because this is not for you. This is only for cups natin that has a light duty cleaner possessions, okay? So again, Pumakap, maraming maraming salamat and see you here in Canada.